Here's a look back then at some of the best pictures of our first race of the day here at Zolder with Norbert Kish starting on the front row alongside Sasha Lenz. It was a great, great battle down towards the first corner for Norby and Sasha, but Norby held on, though, to remain in front and, of course, would try and move away from the front of the pack as best he could to then go on and take another race three victory. Antonio Albacetti and Jochen Hahn on the second row were well aware that the battles could reign through this one and it was going to be a tough, tough fight for them, but still... The two very experienced heads were not able to overcome Sasha Lenz, even in the later stages where it seemed like Jochen was able to rein him in slightly. In the middle of the pack, it was certainly a big, big fight between Jose Eduardo Rodriguez and Steffi Halm. Unfortunately, Steffi not finishing the race by the end and Jose Eduardo Rodriguez going on to finish that one. But Andre Kurzim had to defend all the way through from Stefan Fass and he certainly had his work cut out to do so. Louis Requenco was running well inside the top 10 before his failure as Jonathan Andre continued to improve his pace as the weekend went on. But I tell you what, once again, great effort from Andre Kurzim to do more defensive driving. But the red flag would ultimately come out after the big, big failure for Louis Requenco and into the gravel. It was certainly a massive fireball, as you see here. But luckily, Louis was fine. The fire went out very quickly, and we hope to see him out again later on. 